Hi Legends, in this episode I will share with you two key support levels that needs to hold for continued bullish momentum to the upside. So stay tuned until the very end not to miss out on any alpha that I'm about to share. Also remember my favorite exchange that I do my daily trading down in the description under exchange Bluffin, no KYC required and also one of the largest sign up bonuses by using this link down in the description to sign up and start trading in minutes. Also legends I've highlighted a small little scalp trade here to the upside that for now is still playing out to perfection. This is the trade that I highlighted to our Legends community. First link down in the description if you'd like to join, where you basically on the five minute time frame, small little scalps here to the up and to the downside. It is just key to know where to take profits. And I've explained this trading setup in detail. Okay, TP1, TP2, and potentially leaving some of the position open here for the 0.618. It is not guaranteed that we're just going to go up from here and go and claim the high that we've made early this morning. So let's go and analyze the price of Bitcoin together. Right, legends, looking at Bitcoin here on the four hour time frame, remember I have spoken about claiming these highs over here, which we now have done. Now, the next thing that Bitcoin needs to do to continue bullish momentum here to the upside, it needs to hold two key support levels for continued bullish momentum to the upside. Now that we've claimed the high over here, you can also see that we are currently trading below this high. Okay. But looking at the structure over here, legends, this does look like a one, two, one, two, three year to the upside. And you can see exactly where we got rejected is at the 1.618, which is a very common third wave target. So if this is a one, two, one, two year to the upside, and this is the explosive third wave, what we would like to see next for the price of Bitcoin is perhaps find some consolidation over here, okay, and still go and complete a fifth wave year to the upside. Only once we've completed the fifth wave here to the upside and I can see a clear one, two, three, four, five wave structure here to the upside, then things are really starting to look good here for the price of Bitcoin. After the fifth wave is then in, we can then still expect a deeper correction when I take a FIP from the lows to the potential highs that still needs to be made. You really want to see us find support inside of the golden zone, okay, and not tapping the 0.88. Right, legends, so the key level that needs to hold just taking the scribble here out the way is to say that, well, if this is, okay, a one, two, one, two, three year to the upside and we are still waiting for this consolidation area to form the fourth wave for another fifth leg year to the upside, the key levels that needs to hold is that when I take a FIB, okay, let's just take this out the way over here, when I take a FIB here from the low okay from this impulse here to the upside to the recent high that we've made over here what i would like to see for this retracement is to find support here at the 382 which is a common fourth wave target and the 50 percent fib level potentially consolidating consolidating and finding support back on top of this trend for a final fifth wave here to the upside fifth waves can be very explosive but what i would like to see is a one two three four five wave structure which then increase the probabilities that any return tracement to the downside could give us another explosive wave to the upside. If Bitcoin is going to lose this high over here, okay, what I mean by lose the high is not reclaim this high over here and we start finding downwards momentum and we start dancing around the 0.618 and even the 786 level losing this trend, there's a great probability that we could potentially come back for a retest, make a lower high over here, okay, where you'll have a trend and we can find continuation here to the downside to even still come and claim this low at $53,280. So right legends we really want the structure to remain bullish and for now if we're going to find downwards momentum here to the downside this is an a b c okay where we've claimed the high and everyone's packing their bitcoin bags only to find continuation here to the downside i really don't want this okay to be a three-wave structure because this can be an a b c and we're going to find downwards momentum i would really like us to build a complete five-wave structure here where we have a one two one two three four five okay once we have a completed five wave structure any retracement thereafter for me could potentially be a great buying opportunity and as always this is my trading plan no financial advice thank you so much for watching please like the content if you enjoy the alpha over here subscribe for future notifications and until the next one legends just for now